So you might be in a weird situation where your guardian of your Oculus Quest 2 isn't working. Now, what does this mean? Well, essentially, when you go through and you actually, you know, turn on your headset and you try to, you know, make a guardian around you, you might be seeing that basically it resets every single time or it's not working or the guardian keeps stopping. There's a lot of things that can end up happening here. So the very first thing I'd recommend doing for the most part is going through and rebooting your specific headset. So go ahead, basically hold down that side button of your headset, just hold it down for as long as you can, and then go through and turn it back on. A lot of the times your issues can be fixed like this, and that might be all you're going to have to do as of this moment. So go ahead and turn it off, completely turn it off, and then turn it on, and that's probably all you're going to have to do there. Now if that's still not working or you're having issues there, the next thing you're going to want to do is see if you're able to go ahead and update your Oculus headset. So what you can do here is you can just go ahead and hold down on your specific headset, turn it on. Go ahead on the right controller. You want to go and click on that Oculus button. And when you do that, a little menu is going to come up. You want to go ahead and click on the clock icon that is right there. And then you want to go into settings. You want to go into system. And then you want to go and click on software update. Now in the top right corner there, you want to go and click on update. And if there's an update available, it's going to go ahead and update your console. And that is probably all you're going to have to do there. Chances are, if you go and do that, your console will then go ahead and reboot. It's going to update and you will see that your guardian will now be fully working. And that's probably all you're going to have to do there. Now from there, if that's still not working, you can clear the cache in your history and you can clear your storage of your specific headset as well. That's what some people have recommended. You may also want to see if you can go ahead and recharge your headset. So go ahead and just you know, plug your headset back in. You can go ahead and replace the controller batteries of your specific you know controllers as well. And that's probably all you're going to have to do there as well. So if it's still not working, you can always contact Meta and have them kind of take a look at it. But that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, till then.